Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you my summer essentials, things that I've been using so much this summer and it's only it's mid-July and already I've been using it a ton and I want to share it with you of what I think that everybody should have or be using this summer. Um, first, I'm going to start with beauty. And for me, I've been switching up my skincare routine a little bit. I no longer use Proactive. Um, I went and got microdermabrasion done to my skin, and my dermatologist told me that it was really drying out my skin and bad. But it's really crucial to take your makeup off at the end of the night, as we all know. And I found this at Target. It's Neutrogena Naturals Fresh Cleansing and Makeup Remover Wash. I use, okay, first I take a face wipe, one of those um, makeup removing towels, and I use that, get all my makeup off, and then I run some warm water and take um, a clean washcloth, and I use this. It does the best job of taking off all your makeup. I just put a, one pump, put it all over my face, take a warm washcloth, and then just kind of gently exfoliate. All your makeup's off, and your f face feels so clean. And I thought that I might start breaking out, but it's actually kept my skin really clear. So I highly recommend this. And I think it was like 6 or $7 at Target. Really, really worth it. So next, um, summer colors for lipstick. My personal favorite must-have, Costa Chic is the color by MAC. It's a frost finish, and it's like this corally, pinky color. So pretty for, especially when you have a little bit of a tan, looks so good. And this color really reminds me of Kourtney Kardashian. Like, I don't know if you watch the Kardashians, but when she's doing her interview, she has like a corally, orangey, pinky lipstick. I feel like this might be the color she's wearing. And then on top, I'll wear Max Cream Sheen Lip Glass in the color Richer Lusher. And this combo is actually what I have on my lips right now. It looks so good, so I highly recommend those too. And then of course, nails. Nail polish is so important for summer, well, year round. You have to have your nails painted. It's like an accessory. And this summer, it's all about, been about the neons. And I've got these three here. Really any neon nail polish, but these ones have been really, really good. This one was seriously $2, I think, at Target, and it actually works really good. I think I did like two coats and then put a clear coat on top and it lasted so long. I would say like 10 days without chipping. And I wore it on my toes, it looked so good. And then I got these ones recently. Um, this one is Orly Glow Stick, such a bright color. Looks really good. And then this one I have on my toes right now. This is Orly's Oh Cabana Boy. And it's like a bright pink with a purple kind of finish to it. It looks so pretty. I have this on and I love it. So I highly recommend Neon Nail Polish. Then, okay, so you want to be wearing your shorts or skirts and you want nice legs. This stuff, I feel like I've been using since even before this summer. Last summer I think I picked it up before I went to Vegas and I fell in love. It works so good. If you have bruises or anything that you need to like kind of cover up, it's seriously like a leg makeup, but it stays on your legs and it looks so good. It gives you this nice sexy sheen and makes your legs look flawless. So it gives you a little bit of a color too, but if you have like a fake tan or um, maybe if, even if you don't have fake tan, it will give you color and make your legs look really, really good. I have it in medium glow. I would go with a little bit darker of a color if you have um, if you have fake tan and you would normally tan your legs. Go a little bit darker. But this stuff, highly recommend. Um, I think it's around $15, but one can. I've had this since last summer. So, so good. Okay, for fashion favorites this summer so far, first of all, my favorite thing is shorts. I wear shorts all the time and I love them. But this summer, I've been really feeling high-waisted shorts, and you can get them in so many different places at so many different price points. My personal favorite have been from Target, and they were $14.99. They have the high waist, and they're dark wash, so you can dress them up or down, and they look really good with a shirt tucked in, and they make your booty look really good, too. That's a plus. 
So I highly recommend those. Also from Target, I've really been feeling their fashion. Like they've had such good stuff in the clothing department lately. Tank tops, just easy casual cotton tank tops you want for summer. And Target had these by Mossimo. And I saw um, somebody wearing them from YouTube. Miss Glamorazzi had this one. And I went and checked them out. And I picked two of them up and now I want to go get more. They're so lightweight, they're so easy to throw on, they're colorful, they're just so comfortable too. And they're really good quality. I've washed them a couple times and they're not like peeling or anything. So I highly recommend Target for tank tops. And I got this color too here. It's a little bit brighter than neon. So yeah, recommend those. They have a little pocket. Also little t-shirts. It's so hot where I live right now. It's like going to be 106 today. So little cotton shirts or tank tops are a must. And I got this one from the Gap Outlet. It has a little pocket here. Um, it was around $10. But also Target has them too. For $10 they have them all different colors. Highly recommend those. Next, sandals. Last summer I spent $60 on a pair of Sam Edelman sandals. In a year, this summer, they've already stretched out. I can't walk in them because they like flip-flop everywhere. So I had to go get a new pair and I went to Target. Found these. They look like the Steve Madden ones. They were $15. They look identical to Steve Madden. I was like, oh my God, I almost bought the Steve Madden ones. Those were $50 at Macy's. So glad I didn't. They had them in brown, black, gold. And I think another color, I can't remember what it was, but I kind of want to go back and get the brown. They're really, really comfortable too. And you know, if they stretch or break or whatever, whatever, they were 15 bucks. They weren't 50 like my other ones. So check Target out for fashion. I highly recommend that. Okay, so next, you have to have this for summer, right? You're by the pool, beach, lake, whatever. Floppy straw hats. And the reason... I love the straw is because they can bend, you can kind of fold them and put them in your beach bag um, without worrying about them like getting all kind of crazy because they form shape really nicely. So, And I love the big floppy hats because obviously they cover your face. So I got this one at Forever 21 again for Las Vegas but I've been wearing it so much this summer because I want to keep the sun off my face. And then if you're not really into the floppy hats, a good one is like a little fedora. This one gives you, you know, nice. <laughs> I mean, it looks cute. But obviously this one's a little bit better for skin protection. Okay, so last, I saw these on Instagram. It's They're kind of like the trendy sunglasses right now. Um, they're by Prada, and I think they're around $400. And you know how like round sunglasses are in? Like, Nicole Richie wears them a lot. Well, I found these at a boutique in Sacramento here. And I seriously saw them for $15. They look identical to the Pradas. They have this little side here. They're round. And they look really cute on. And I just really liked them. Plus, they're trendy. I mean, if they're going to go out of style... Oops, I caught in my hair. If they're going to go out of style... So what? They're 15 bucks. Whereas if you got the Pradas, those are 400 A little bit steep. But you have to have a pair of sunglasses. So I hope that um, this gives you some ideas. Let me know your summer favorites or summer essentials that you have to have below. Comment below and let me know. And thanks for watching. Bye.